Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. Let me back up a little bit. Um, on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and styling, guys. So, today I'm going to do a quick little review on this bag. Um, you guys, I'm going to actually tag in the video that I did for the other bag. But I got another Mansour Gabrielle bag. I think that's how you pronounce it. I've been saying it like that. And here's my issue with the bag. So, I love the material, the quality of the bag. I, I will say that hands down. Um, I bought a kind of taupish, tannish color before, and it came in a regular shipping box. And then inside of that shipping box was another box, right? This particular bag that I got now is a different color, same bag, but a different color. And here's my dilemma. Here's my issue. When the box was delivered, it was a smaller box. So I immediately knew something wasn't right. So I opened the box and the bag literally was in like their shipping box with their name inside like this. I know, I know. It's, it's, I'm being dramatic, no I'm not. I feel, <laughs> no I'm not. I feel like it took away from the customer's unboxing experience. The bag was on sale for like, because I think I originally paid for the other one $5.95 and I think they went up to $6.95. Um, you go up in price and then you take away the box. So it just comes in a shipping box. It wasn't enough tissue paper. So I thought maybe it was the last bag that was on sale and they just kind of threw it together. So I sent them an email and I asked, like, hey, um, I'm a little disappointed in the packaging of this bag. Um, is this the last bag? Is this how the new bags are going to be shipped? And they basically told me, I could read it to you guys. I'm going to read it. Let me see if I can find it really quick. They basically said, like, you know, about sustainability, blah, 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 blah. I'm not even gonna read it. Yes, they've talked about sustainability and that yes, the new bags will be shipped like that. The bags are not super expensive, guys. I think I've seen maybe $800, maybe. But these are lambskin. So I figured that you're risking something being damaged by FedEx and UPS and whoever else, right? I've seen them toss these things around. I've, I've received uh, packages from FedEx that was completely smashed and ruined the item. So that was my little rant on it. The shipping is trash right now. I, I don't like it. So I will probably will not be purchasing another bag from them. However, the bag is still nice. The only thing I can say is that I do feel that this was the last bag that they got gave me. Um, can you guys see? It's a little bright, but I'm gonna come a little closer. It's the white, it's so bright. It's the white one. It's so bright, right? The only thing I can say is that it looks a little wrinkled, so that means that they probably had it sitting somewhere, but the bag is still a really nice bag. Um, tissue on the inside, you guys know that the insides of the bag are also lambskin, right? So the bag is amazing. It's a snap, close it, just like the other one. So, yeah, I just, I wasn't, I wasn't, sorry. I wasn't pleased at all with their packaging this time. The bag is still much so very cute. I'm gonna probably put some more tissue paper in here because they didn't even put enough of it. I had to fill it with some more paper that I had. But this is the bag. Um, let me step back so you guys can see. Um, it's the same thing like my other one, just white. It's a pretty white color. I wanted it to go with some shoes that I have and like this top or whatever. Fall is coming, but I'm, your girl's still gonna throw a little bit of white colors in here. Um, but this is the bag, still a very nice bag. But let me know what you guys think. Would you be frustrated or upset that your purchase, your money, your hard earned money for something that, if you, would you be upset that you purchased something and it just came like this? inside of a shipping box. Let me know if I'm going crazy or if I'm just overreacting, but to go from 
this to having this inside of another like uh, inside of another box to this I mean I don't know let, let me know what you guys think I just think that they're not a huge brand I don't think well they're not but the quality is still good I'm disappointed I'm gonna say that I am I just kind of feel like and I thought maybe they did it because they have it on sale I don't know I didn't want to pay full price for it because I'm like it's white I might destroy it um, so I, I literally waited for it to go on. So you guys know I'm not really like a big sale shopper, but if I do buy something on sale, it's something that I already wanted and it so happened to go on sale. But I don't know, I just kind of feel like the customer is not gonna be happy. Imagine paying $800 for a bag and it comes like that. That tells me a lot about the brand itself. Listen, I bought tissue from Chanel. Chanel prides themselves on their packaging. The tissue, was packaged like a bag was packaged so I don't know maybe they'll see this video and I did like I said I left a comment I said I don't think that's a good idea you're risking the bags being damaged by the carrier and imagine a bag being destroyed now you have to replace it as a business owner I don't know <laughs> let me know what you guys think I don't think I'm overreacting I just think that this was just bad shipping um, you guys know how I really feel about Brixton trash like it's super trash packaging um, and I think with Brixton the issue is the box itself they're not using hat boxes in the box itself it's not even good um, I was about to say wood it's not good cardboard like it's cheap cardboard so I don't know why they're not just investing in their packaging because your product could be a little kind of shaky, but if your packaging is good, we love packages, packaging. So Monsaw Gariel, I hope I'm saying your name right. This is my second purchase from you guys and I'm not happy with it, um, with how it was packaged. The bag is okay. I do understand it was the last bag, so it probably was sitting somewhere, who knows. <laughs> um, but I think you guys should continue, go back to your old packaging um because personally i will not purchase another bag um that's gonna come like this in just inside of just a shipping box so that is my quick review on this bag guys but again the leather is really good but if you don't mind getting a bag like this and minimal tissue paper like imagine sending this to somebody as a gift if you don't mind it still shop them um you know they do have good quality like i said but I wish they would do go back to this or even get a smaller box because the box is big as all heck. Get a smaller box, save money on a smaller box, but still have it inside its own box. This guys is not acceptable in my opinion, but who am I? <laughs> so let me know what you guys think. Would you be upset that you got a bag like this that you spent your money on um, and the color is white or you really don't care as long as you got your bag. But if you like videos like this, please comment below. And if you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco We See You. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NY. That is my, my business page. And Coco Styles NYC is my personal page for tall girl styling. And then Coco Styles NYC is my blog. And Coco Styles NY.com is my style services for corporate professional women, guys. So I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.